I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Good morning, Prescott Badgers. This is Tristan. And Eric. For Badger Media. Today where, is... Where have you been? I've been sick. Why have you been here? Because I'm sick. I went on by myself Friday. Sorry, I was sick. Yeah. Anyway, today is Monday, November 5th, 2018, and these are your daily announcements. Students, Yavapai County Education Service Agency will be continuing the Christmas card contest this year. Cards will need to be turned in by November 14th, 2018 at 5 p.m. to be entered into the contest. I really want to put a card in, but I'll I'm not very it. good at it, so whatever. You're probably not. <laughs> Thanks. Anyways, freshmen, sophomore, and juniors, come experience CTA, CTE Day. Friday, November 16th, 8.30 to 1. Stop by the counseling office to sign up and get a trip permit. Limited seating and lunch provided. I might just go for the lunch. Come enjoy Prescott High School's fall production of the female version of Neil Simon's The Odd Couple. This production involves two entirely different casts. We encourage you as an audience member to take advantage of a special offer and watch both cast versions of the show. Simply pay for one cast show and bring back your ticket stuff to see the other one for free. Ticket prices are $8 for adults. $5 for students with IDs, and free admission to PUSD facility and staff with IDs. That's totally unfair. Tickets can be pre-purchased at the book st PHS Bookstore through the PUSD online portal and or at the box office 30 minutes before the show. We hope to see you at one of these hilarious shows. Come support PHS and the Theater Arts Department. Keeping our schools and community safe is always on our minds in PUSD and across the country. We're excited to share a donation from Davidson's Ruger and National Shooting Sports Foundation. These companies have, do have donated gun locks to the local school districts. These are available to any PUSD parent. Parents can stop in the principal's office to receive a free lock. Additionally, they will be available at the district office reception desk at 300 East Gurley Street during office hours. Thank you, Davidson's Ruger and National Shooting Sports Foundation for helping us Keep our schools safe. Prescott High School partners with the Launchpad to provide opportunities for students to engage in clubs and activities after the school day is over. The Launchpad is a community organization that provides programming that is culturally relevant to teens in the Yapai County. Through this partnership, students are eligible to receive tutoring when needed and participate in programs of their interest. In addition to tutoring, students can take advantage of the mentoring program. The pro the, this program gives students an opportunity to set goals and receive support as they seek to achieve success. Shuttle services available if you're interested in learning more. Visit the link below. And for clubs, if you love reading, nope. come to, to the next PHS Book Club meeting on Wednesday, November 7th during lunch in room 411 to discuss the book Six of Crows and have fun with the book club. Attention, photo club. There is a schedule change. Next meeting is moved forward to November 7th, this coming Wednesday, room 70 at lunch. Subject, headshots. I think I was supposed to say that, but that's all right. Today for lunch, there's seasoned curly fries, whole grain ham and cheese sub, whole grain turkey and cheese sub, three cheese panini, East Coast Italian wrap, homemade whole grain chicken and waffles with the syrup cup, cinnamon French toast and scrambled eggs with the syrup cup, and crispy hash brown potato patty. I love me a good hash brown potato patty. I love me some good old chicken waffles. <laughs> and for breakfast, we have... Whole grain honey bi honey chicken biscuit, Ooh. strawberry mango smoothie with graham crackers, Ooh. whole grain bagel with cream cheese pouch, Ooh. zucchini cake, wow. my favorite, dude, rice check cereal with graham crackers, golden grams with graham crackers, honey nut Cheerios cereal with graham crackers, and sliced peaches. I like the sliced peaches. And on November 13th, a Thanksgiving lunch will be served, which will consist of roasted turkey, mashed potatoes with gravy, green bean casserole, orange cranberry sauce, and pumpkin cheesecake. And mashed taters. You already said that. Hey Badgers, this is Hayden and Leighton for sports. 
Track, sprinters, hurdlers, and jumpers. There are winter practices. If, you're, if you are available Tuesday and Thursday at 5 p.m. and on Saturdays at 7.30 a.m., meet at the track. There is a parent informational meeting for anyone interested in being a part of the Prescott High School League of Legends team on November 14th at 6 p.m. in the cafeteria. Rise and grind, gamers. Let's get this bread. Winter tryout, work, winter tryout week is over. Congrats to everyone who made a team. Get, for, get more information on all upcoming meets, matches, and games at PrescottBadgers.com. Join us next time for more sports information. And we're back. This day in history, in 1492, Christopher Columbus first learns about growing the growing and harvesting maize, aka corn, from Cuba's indigenous population. Wow, that's events, interesting. Here are the events on campus for this week. The Prescott High School High School Air Force J Rodsey is presenting the Veterans Wall on November 9th. It will be in the Prescott High School lobby from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. The intention of the wall is to honor veterans and their service to our country. The wall includes names and pictures of veterans. If you know anyone who has served and would like them to be included in the veterans wall, please send in their name, their branch, their rank, and where they served in the link below. And for the advisement center, we have news. <laughs> Are you interested in learning more about Grand Canyon University and attending a campus visit? On November 27th, GCU will be sending a bus to pick up interested PHS students to take them on a tour of their Phoenix campus. Lunch will be provided by GCU. Come by and pick up a permission slip and return it by November 19th. We can only take one bus, so first come, first serve. If you have any questions, please contact your advisor. And for weather, today's forecast calls for highs around 70 and lows around 40. 40% 40 chance of rain, 71% humidity, and 13 mile per hour winds. And now for our daily Twitter poll. Friday's question was, are you planning to driving to the Phoenix for the football game? There, the results were 9% voted definitely, 17% voted maybe, and 74% of you voted no way, Jose. Way to support our Badgers. Yeah, guys, come on. Today's question is, what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? Go follow our Twitter at Badger underscore media and vote now. Fact of the day, researchers believe that dolphins are incapable of smell. Once they are born, they apparently do not show any olfactory nerves, so their sense of smell appears to be non-existent. As always, Badgers, thanks for watching, and hope you'll join us tomorrow for more news. Adios.